All right, so this is our second report, kind of a status report on working on our 1991 Corvette, uh, customer's car. And as I was saying in the prior video, a lot of people know what Corvettes look like from the top side. It's a very distinctive silhouette and body style, but a lot of people don't know what a Corvette looks like on the underside. And even more specifically, people don't know what a bad catalytic converter looks like. Now, this car is a 1991, so it's got what's called OBD1 uh, software or electronics. And uh, that means it's only got one oxygen sensor, usually up here in the manifold um, that reports back to the computer. So this car has three Kelly converters. There's one for each of the two banks on the downpipes. And where the pipes merge, right there, there's another Kelly converter. And this particular customer was not really complaining, but concerned about a muffler rattle and has stock mufflers on it. I've never really seen those rattles. I suspected a bad catalytic converter and you see I got my lights set up here and I'm gonna focus in on that. This is the core of the catalytic converter. You can see I can, it just rattles around. This thing's been broken for a long time. Now, a lot of people are like, oh, we don't need catalytic converters, you know, gut it out, whatever. But you know, let's uh, take it easy on Mother Earth. Uh, it's there for a reason. The problem with this, when they break like this, this one's been broken for a while, is the core has separated from the casing. And if it turns sideways like this, it's like a banana in your exhaust pipe. And nobody wants a banana in their exhaust pipe on a Corvette. I mean, that's the worst. But it can actually, you know, shut a lot of power down. Uh, turn the power off, reduce power, whatever you want to say. This is a pretty extreme example. And you can tell, that would be a rattle. Anytime exhaust is flowing through there, it's it's moving that around, it's gonna sound like a mariachi band playing underneath your car. Um, I've seen this quite often, but I thought it might be interesting for those folks who have never seen what a bad catalytic converter looks like. Now, if this was an OBD2 car, there would be an oxygen sensor in the exhaust pipe right beyond the catalytic converter measuring its efficiency, and the check engine light would have come on a long time ago saying this, is bad, but this is not that type of car. It's it's uh, pre-OBD2, it's OBD1, and it does not have that software. So we're gonna replace that Kelly converter with the exact stock one and uh, make this customer happy. And then while we're underneath here, I think I explained I had to take that great big cross brace down so I had access to servicing the transmission. I gotta take the transmission pan down. And that great big cross brace is right there. It's huge. Look at that thing. That goes underneath the car, helps stiffen it up. It's a convertible. So that's part two of our Corvette uh, repair and just thought somebody might find it interesting. <laughs> Thanks for checking out my channel, subscribing. Your annotations and comments are much appreciated. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.